So, <laughs> Cub Swanson woke up yesterday and absolutely chose violence against Darren Elkins. I mean, that was that was beyond impressive, man. I mean, like we all know just how good. I mean, I'm actually gonna put that fight in the beginning of this video, in the intro, so uh, you guys can rewatch that. I mean, that was just absolutely gorgeous. The way he stepped to the left. Fired off that beautiful uh, left straight from Southpaw. Followed up with a right hook. Uh, left hook again sat him down. And then just ran circles around him. Almost knocked his head off clean with that wheel kick. It was just, just a beautiful performance. Thank you. Beautiful performance. Vintage Cup Swanson. You could tell the man was absolutely motivated for that one. But um, we're going to do a fighter showcase. Since we didn't get to do one before the fight. Gonna use Cub. Oh my god. Oh, we got ourselves a, a motivated Jose Aldo right here. This man is moving well. Get him, George YT. I guess this man is on YouTube. Nice spin. Oh, look at these elbows. Nice. Oh. Dude, what the heck is going on? I need to be very careful with this guy because if there's anything that Jose is going to have an advantage on, it's... Oh, my God. Jeez. What the heck? Hold on, folks. Yeah. Give me a sec. This dude is having a little bit too much fun. Get up, buddy. Mm -mm. You're having a little bit too much fun, buddy. We're going to put a stop to that. Get up. That's circling to the left with the knee that he's doing. Uh-huh. Gonna keep throwing your knees. It's just not gonna do much for you, I promise you that. There we go. Nope. Alright, he started off the first round with a bang. He really did. Dropped me, I believe, twice. But, uh, yeah, we were kind of, I, like, I mean, I was like asleep. <laughs> I was a little bit asleep. I mean, you guys know that meme? The meme where you start playing somebody and you're kind of leaning back in your chair a little bit. But then you realize, oh my god, they're being serious. And so you sit up a little bit. That's literally what happened in that first round. I was kind of sleeping a bit. And then this dude, this freaking guy, try to style on me. How dare you, bro? You crazy? How dare you try to style on me with Jose Aldo? You are not that guy. Careful, you're about to you're about to eat a duck straight. That's what you're about to eat right now. Keep throwing that one two at me. Uh-huh. If you don't mind, get back up, brother. Whoa! What? Ugh. God dang, get back, get back up. No. No, sir. No. I don't appre- No. No, 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 no. That's not- 
That is not acceptable. Bye. Damn. Dude, that, that flying knee he landed at the end right there, like close to the end right there, I think I ducked into it. Because the way my fighter dropped, that, that's, it was unusual. Left hook. That beautiful Cub Swanson left hook. A gorgeous left hook he likes to throw. So he knocked this dude dead. Yeah, let's not let's not start another fight like that, man. Let's let's wake up. Let's move on. Uh-huh. Let's get it. Another Jose Aldo. We've been running into quite a few Aldo players lately. I think more players are trying to figure out Jose. I mean, it's not really too much to figure out. His Aldo style in in a lot of ways is fairly straightforward. Um, but that doesn't mean that everybody can use Aldo properly. I mean, there are few few players in the game that have mastered Jose. Everyone else kind of just wings it, you know? Everyone else kind of just does the classic one, two, leg kick, leg kick. Which, of course, I mean, it's a very good way to use Aldo. Let's just be honest, because it's uh, like getting into a leg kick in war with Aldo in this game is just a terrible idea. I mean, you could if you know exactly what you're doing, like right there. If you just checked one of my kicks, that's bad. If he checks more of them, you guys are going to see my leg absolutely hurt. Huh? Are you trying to do what I think you're trying to do right now? Look at him. Inching his way forward. Okay. Okay, sir. I like the aggression. I like it. I like the aggression. Come on. Keep it coming. I'm starting to see more players actually come into fight, and I could not be happier. I would like to think that uh, all of my talks about how players got to fight back, and I'd like to think that it's, oh my god, see what I mean? That's two checked kicks. So I sit him down, two checked kicks by Aldo, and my leg is already hurt. It's, it's just it's so dangerous trying to throw leg kicks at Aldo. But I'm not going to stop, though. I mean, I have to keep throwing him. Yeah, I'd like to think uh, the talk is having an effect. Because I am noticing more players actually fighting back. And I guarantee if you sat these players down and you asked them, what is, what is, uh, like, what's your experience in terms of how many fights you've, you've been winning since you started trying to be a bit more aggressive you'll see their win rate has gone up I promise you that definitely gone up more than it's gone down like this dude right here that I'm fighting right now this would be a a lot easier if he was just backing up from me but the fact that he's coming forward he's actually like putting me in a situation where like I'm I'm having to Like, this is a fight right here. Nice. Okay. Very good first round. Able to sit him down with that jab, uppercut. I think he was going to the body when the uppercut hit him. So that was just like a, like a clean knockdown. Thank you, sir. Keep it coming. Oh. Head kick. Yes. I knew he was really trying to block that low kick. Fire off a head kick from a mile away. Got him. There we go. Sit him down. Oh, God. Nice. Nice. <laughs> This is a great fight. This is a great fight. You guys cannot tell me you are not entertained by what's going on right now. This is an incredible match here.
And he goes southpaw. Look at him. He's going southpaw because that leg is probably donezo. And he's throwing leg kicks with the same leg. Or maybe he just wants to give me a different a different look. Is that what you're doing, bro? You're giving me a different look, man. Fight through the fakes. Don't get caught watching. Got him. Set him down. A couple principles, man, that if you guys apply, you're, you're definitely going to see a huge uptick in uh, your win rate. One of them definitely is fight through the fakes. If, you, if you're fighting somebody that's faking, fake, 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 fake. Fake it, Mr. Fake Fake. You gotta like just just ignore that. Ignore it. Fight through it. There we go. When I watch you guys play against certain content creators, and they're just they're, they're doing all these like intricate fakes, the, the leg fake, the, the jab fake, the takedown fake, and you're just watching. I'm like, what are you doing? Like, why are you sitting there watching him fake? Like, go up, go, go punch him in the face. Like, there's nothing. What are you watching? What are you waiting for? When you start hitting them, all those fakes nonsense goes away. The faking, the, the fake, fake, fake is when two players have agreed to play patty cake, essentially. Which is okay. Doing that is fine. I mean, it's it can be like a battle of wit when you both try to do that. It's like, oh, let's see who can trick each other the most. But, like, you don't need to play that game, bro. You don't need to play that game. If somebody is <clears throat> using, I don't know, Wonder Boy or Izzy, and they're, like, doing all these, like, intricate fakes... And you're standing there like, oh my god, what's coming? Oh, Jesus Christ, he's... Oh, look at these fakes. Oh, what a beautiful... Bro. March forward and go hit him. You'll be surprised. A lot of that is... A lot of that is fugazi. There's nothing there. Nice. Another one. That's a beautiful combo. That's straight into a leg kick. Because what he can also do with that combo is he can go... There we go. Set him down. What he can do with that combo too is he can go for a straight into a head kick. So he's going straight leg kick, straight leg kick. He primes you and gets you ready. Like right there, next up is going to be like a straight head kick. I think that's what he's trying to do. Let's hope Flu we don't fucking fall for it. Which means I got to almost let him keep hitting me. Gotta keep letting letting him hit me with that. Str oh, don't do that! <laughs> don't switch your stance for no reason. What are you doing? Oh my god! Oh my god! This man switched his stance for absolutely no reason. Posture and get back up. Mm, what are we doing? Body, body, body. To your body. What? The heck happened to my attempts? Like kick. There we go. Oh boy. Jose Aldo is getting butchered, folks. Another leg kick. Oh, but he's tired now. He's tired. Ah. Leg kick. Leg kick. Ooh, man. No, don't do it. I thought he was about to quit for a sec. Like, damn. Mm-hmm. Oh, my 
my god. <laughs> oh my god. Damn, what a finish. Superman punch for the win. That is such that is such a Cub Swanson type of finish right there. Be look at this. Boom! Beautiful shot. And that boy is knocked out cold. Knocked out cold. There it is. There it is. Hope you guys enjoyed the fighter showcase. Major props and congratulations to Cub Swanson on that beautiful performance, especially in front of his whole entire family. That had to have made him proud, man. He went out there and put on a flawless performance, man. It was gorgeous. Truly was. Vintage, vintage Cub Swanson. Beautiful pinpoint accurate striking. Very, very powerful shots. And then the way he ended it, you know, it was just so clean. So clean. Anyways, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys later with a brand new one. As always, stay safe. Peace out.